What's better than a Photoshop art challenge? A Photoshop art challenge with free stocks. Our first contest of the year has landed and this one will push your creative skills to the limit. The question is, can you handle the challenge? We've just dropped a brand new, totally free stock bundle for all you photo manipulation fans and it's a beast. To celebrate the launch, we thought it'd be fun to see what you guys can do with these assets. We're proud to introduce Drop Zero, a contest that absolutely anyone can join and a fun way to push your photo manipulation skills to the max. The setup is simple, all you have to do is download our newest free stock bundle and create an artwork using the included assets and that's pretty much it. So why all the melodrama? Why am I asking if you can handle the challenge? Well I'm glad you asked because this is where things get tricky. You can create any type of artwork in any genre as long as you use the stocks from the freebie bundle. Even though this one is a chunky boy with 200 plus stocks, it's actually a lot more challenging than it sounds. With this contest we ask, what can you conjure up with limited resources? How can you combine these elements to create something fresh and new? That's the spiritual core of this challenge, innovation, imagination and the ability to overcome limits and restrictions. Even though there's limited resources, there's an unlimited number of ways that these assets can be chopped up, combined and remixed to create something new. Here's a look at some of the entries that we've had from our Facebook community. First up is Furious Edits who combine multiple characters and costume elements to create a totally brand new look, Dyson and Splicing to create this awesome fantasy edit. Then we have Liam Doran's entry, where he transformed our CG wizard into a raptor wrangler, because why the hell not? It's been really interesting to see the crossovers and similarities in composition and concept, like these two amazing entries from Simon Johns and Sujit Sakar, both very solid interpretations of the same character. We've seen a lot of fantasy submissions, like this great dragon piece from Chris Carlson Gonzalez, as well as more left field entries like this amazing post-apocalyptic artwork by longtime channel fan Barbara McFarland. Shout out Celtic Babs, awesome work yet again. And then we have the freaks and geeks, such as Stephen Lindsay aka The Iron Parasite, who submitted this outrageous sci-fi horror creation with just a little dash of Hellraiser. I put myself firmly in this weirdo category and I wear the badge with pride. Keep your eyes peeled for my submission which will be dropping very soon. Now you've had a little taste of inspiration, let's get into the Drop Zero art challenge rules. The premise is simple. Create an artwork that uses the assets in the freebie stock bundle, which can be any theme or genre. You can use assets from other sources, but the final piece must include 80% or more from the freebie bundle. It's strictly one entry per person, we want your very best effort for this one. Once finished, email your finished submission to contest at photomanipulation.com before the challenge end date, Sunday 30th of April. As ever, we like to run a newbie friendly operation, so there's two prize tiers for this challenge. Tier 1 is Best Technique and will be awarded to the submission that demonstrates the best technical prowess and mastery of the folk manipulation art form. An undeniable stone cold stunner that wows the community. Tier 2 is Most Imaginative. This prize will be awarded to the artwork or concept that is the most imaginative and innovative, not necessarily the most technically proficient. Newbies, this could be your chance to shine as this tier isn't judged on technical skill. Come up with something truly clever or groundbreaking and you're in with a chance. We encourage you to share your artwork on social media and if you want to spread the word, link out to the freebie stock bundle, that helps everyone out too. You can use these assets for personal projects outside of this contest and even commercial projects too. For more info, check out the FAQ page on the stock download page, link in the description. You've got just under two weeks to put something in so the countdown starts now. Link to the contest page and stock download form is in the description. Go forth and create and remember. May the odds be ever in your favour.